did you move to ATL from oh, Connecticut? Um, I actually moved to Atlanta when I was about eight years old. It was a family move. Okay, my okay. My pops had got transferred down here, so okay. just been down here ever since. Because I looked at a lot of your stuff, man. Uh -huh. you know, I was very impressed from the CD. I mean, first of all, I seen this man perform first. Right, right. Then, you know, I, you know, we met and we talked. He gave me a CD. I listened to the CD. I said, hold up. This man's so dope, I gotta go look at old stuff. Man, I see the video of you with the, with the jersey on, when the jersey was popping. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the, and and the moving yeah. up video. <laughs> yeah. Throwback song. Man, you dope, man. You Thank dope, you, sir. man. Where, where you get the inspiration for the talent that you have? Man? Uh, man, I'm just a student of hip hop, man. Like, I really grew up in it. So, like, for me, it was like Nas, Outcast, you know, people like the Tupac. It's a huge inspiration. Right. Um, yeah. But I'm really just a student of the game, so really I give credit to everybody that's ever touched the microphone because I absorb everything. For sure, for sure. But what what made you go the other route of not being a cursor or uh -huh. being degrading, you know, degrading women? Yeah, stereotypes. And, you know, what made you go that opposite route where so, you know, they don't really, you know, be they, they don't feed into not being negative. Right. You know, you're a very positive dude. Absolutely. You talk, you salute God, you Christ, and I listen to your music like heaven, like, like yeah. you know. Um, I mean, really, it was just about putting my personality into the music. I didn't want to be a carbon copy of something else that's already out there. Sure. Um, and I felt like if I'm gonna do it, I might as well be honest. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because otherwise, you could you could put so much energy into doing what everybody else is doing and still not make it. So right. like, if that were to happen, I would be super disappointed. Um, so how did the whole Fresh and Local crew thing come up? Oh, come Fresh up? and Local. Um, <laughs> For sure, Fresh and Local. Yeah, Shout yeah, out. Fresh and Local. Fresh and local. <laughs> right. But um, basically, it's a crew of people that just kind of like felt displaced as far as this whole Atlanta scene goes. Like, right. You know, we're not really in the trap realm. We're not really doing that. So right. it's just like we came together under the same principles. Like, all right, we don't fit in. So what are we going to do to fit in? Yeah. Do we want to fit in? Right. You know what I'm saying? And the answer was no. So we decided to do our own thing. We started recording together, coming up with different marketing ideas and stuff like that. And eventually we started um, coming up with the clothing, the Fresh and Local, the hats and everything. You can go to freshandlocalatl.com and get that. So um, yeah, man, it was just a bunch of people that had the same idea. Right, right, right. I feel you. That's what's up, man. That's what's up, man. So we definitely about to get to this new joint. You know what I mean? Okay. That I've heard. I haven't heard it yet. You know what I'm saying? But oh, yeah, this is, this is brand new music. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So let them know what we about to get into. Uh, it's a song called uh, Django, actually. Django. Um, Django. Yes, sir. And it's off of my next project that's about to drop very soon. It's called Rise of Atlantis. I had that out before the summer. What, what's the name of the CD I got? The one you got is called Above the Freight. Oh. Above the Freight. Yeah, y'all need to check that, that one out. That you right there. You get in and then work your way on. <laughs> like, you don't have like to skip like nothing. A, right, it's like you a series. You just play it through. <laughs> My favorite is the last song. What's the name of I don't know the oh, name. Oh, you're talking about um, Atonement. God Got Me. God Got Me. God got me. Uh -huh. What made you come up with that concept? Oh, uh, man. At the time when I wrote that song, I was going through just a little situation. I, was, I didn't really know what direction I wanted to go. Um, music wasn't, you know, paying off the way I thought I, I should be receiving it. Mm -hmm. And, um, but I just went back to my faith and right. um, decided right. to make a song about it and just try to encourage myself right. as well as other people that are going through similar things in their own walks of life. Right, right, right. I gotta let you hear that. That's my like my favorite all time. Yeah, we didn't make Jay it to the end because I was like, okay, go back, go back. <laughs> like, yeah, why did we say? Go back. What do you say? <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> but yeah, man, let me know what we're getting to right now. It's called Django. It's on Rise of the Land. For sure. Way before the vine, snapping the moment, we was rapping to capture the moment. And nowadays, it's like I'm trying to rehab the components. Back for a cold and getting drafted my homies. We grind up a back of the coat, was at the track with this own that I'm in it. Watch spirits plague in my mind, got me so confused. Shooting the breeze, sipping wine, let her open views. That's why I never got into drinking and smoking instead of leaning and cooking. Y'all in the demons exposed, and I'm writing. Trying to believe my brothers for their behavior. Cause when you hit your teens, you desperately need a savior. Renegade, been a stray, can't talk to me. Cause when you stay home, I'm i i 
the chances of making it, but I'm happily taking it to the casket and grave as I dream. Been through the rain, but it's no evaporating my scheme. Been contemplating doing dirt so I can make it out clean. My life story, you make it all. You from my block, you either trying to smoke some weed or fall. I think it's both, cause it's got to shit. Bacon Tyson, when your mama need help. Cooking chickens, they talking Tyson, cause your father ain't there. We put our fears to the side, hop the video, get some pride. You ain't gotta have an ego to get killed over pride, dog. You see the movies, once it start a relation. Well, in that case, you see the new movies, they call them a shit. If you imagine pest control without extermination, I gotta ask, cause when you living with the roaches and rats, it's hard to find peace. That's because we're born a black, check your economy. Black hearts, 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 can you count up all the cracks that's in your concrete? How many times you lose before you went on Wall Street? Blood on my hands from coming. The innocent lives we lost behind these enemy lines of war for empires like Terrence Howard. Scouting for manpower to give us a spree. My sentences describe sentences. Violence collides. Images sitting in the air. It's back when they listen to the tree. To so when they read his manuscripts and flip them with ease. Money don't come away. I got it. It's time to read these files. Right, right, right. You got it. I 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 got it. Holding on to my scrolls like archaeology. Okay. If death is coming, I'm trying to preserve my essence like astrology. No vibe with me. Grew up like a screw up where they do up. Red and blew up through the sewer. Got them shooters holding tools up. Spot the foe, locking low. They sprouting out like tulips. Precipitation, elimination, the participation. Room and shoot just get low like agriculture. Carry the toaster in their savage culture. Catastrophes bringing our families closer. Within the distance, with these memories, we have If anything, they have to remember me for my passion. Especially in the past. My father, I thought they'd do some courage and they cowardly. In my colony with ammo If you feel misrepresented Take the time to change the channel oh. Black Hawks I'm a Django Mine still shine <laughs> Hey, 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 it's your girl, Ejene. It's your boy, Smoke Rep and B-More, all day, every day. And we're back, RDTV1. Hey, man, I, I know y'all heard that smash hit, man. Django hey. by Jay Nolan. Jay Nolan. Hey, Fresh and local crew, y'all already know what it is, Indeed. man. It's going down, man, for real. Each and every Tuesday. 9.30 p.m. ish. I'm just playing. RDTV1, man, y'all already know what it is, man. Let them know where they can find you at, man. Yeah, all across social media, Instagram, Twitter, Real J Nolan, R-E-A-L-J-N-O-L-A-N. You can go to realjnolan.com, all updates, you know what I'm saying? I've got music placed on television shows, the whole nine, all the updates on that stuff, realjnolan.com. But let them know where they can check you out at Friday. Yeah. Friday. What's the name of the venue? Rock the Mic, Smokey Easy is going down, man, 6340, right. Highway 85. That's your boy Smoke in Riverdale. Up too. In Riverdale. <laughs> so it's going down, man. Y'all already know, man. Y'all come on out, man. The winner get the opportunity to get a distribution deal with Universal. So, yeah. you know, why not? You know, you pay mm -hmm. 10, 20, 30, 40 dollars and change your life. Yeah. Change your Perfect. life. Like, you know, if you're not confident in yourself, then who else gonna be confident in you? Oh, no. so but you gotta bring it when you come, cause it's not it's not a game, it's not a joke. And it will be now. real. It People is from out of town, traveling, everywhere, they come making in. arrangements to yes, get in to and try to get that deal. All right, it's your girl Ejene. It's your boy Smoke Rep and Be More all day every day. RDTV One. We will be back with the beautiful Miss Calandra Glenn, for and we sure. want to appreciate the Jay Nolan. I appreciate y'all for the fresh and local crew. Let them know where they can find you one more time. RealJNolan.com at RealJNolan, R E A L J O J N O L A N, excuse me. And if you're interested in the Fresh and Local gear, go to FreshandLocalATL.com. For sure. All right, appreciate y'all. Oh, we don't leave yet. I need to take a picture. I need a picture. I ain't never hear you here. I know it's your birthday, but I didn't get some pictures. I'm here. Hey y'all! Uh, hey, hey, we're gonna we're gonna give a <laughs> shout out. We're gonna come over, sit up. You can sit right here. And sit right there. We're gonna bring her in, and we're gonna run this eight minutes. And um, how much time? No. 